Ivan Demidov brings excitement for Canadians fans. Ivan Demidov has generated a lot of excitement among Canadians fans since being drafted fifth overall in the NHL Draft 2024. Remarkably, Demidov, considered the best player in the draft class, was still available when the Canadians made their selection. Demidov is unlike any prospect the Canadians have had the opportunity to select in, well, forever. You have to go all the way back to Guy Lafleur to find a comparable level of excitement, and many of you weren't born when Lafleur was drafted and played with the Habs. For the last 20 years, Habs fans have been longing for a player like Demidov. Finally, they got him. Demidov is a genuinely elite offensive talent with top-line scoring upside. In 47 combined regular season and playoff games at the MHL level in Russia, Demidov produced 34 goals, 54 assists, and was a plus 66. The Canadians haven't had a point-per-game forward in their lineup since Alex Kovalev, 84 points in 2008. In time, Demidov will likely eclipse Kovalev's total. Let's talk about Demidov. Ivan Demidov is the most singularly skilled prospect in this year's draft, and it might not even be all that close. He's a human highlight reel. Even the most seemingly anodyne touches have the chance to turn into something special when the puck's on his stick. And when Demidov is on the ice, there's a better chance than not that's the case. That's not because he's a puck hog either. Well, he kind of is, but that's not the main reason. You can attribute that instead to his constant scanning, heightened sense of anticipation, and a motor that never stops. Lean on dated stereotypes about how Russians play hockey at your own peril. Demidov shirks all of them. He's a committed 200-foot player who is physically engaged and reads the game one, two, sometimes three steps ahead of his opponents. At least this was often the case in the MHL this past season, a league he'd so clearly outgrown before his draft year even started. What makes Demidov special, though, is what happens after he's won the puck. An alarmingly high number of those steals or offensive zone puck retrievals almost immediately develop into scoring plays. Sure, there's the hands. Demidov is a dexterous, mechanically sound puck handler with the sort of fast twitch wrists necessary to bring his ideas to life. It doesn't take a veteran scout to appreciate the art he's putting on screen every time he carries the puck through the offensive zone. What might go unnoticed or perhaps even underappreciated is the way he sets up those dangles. Little things like the posture that sells a move one way before he cuts across an opponent's frame and into space in the opposite direction. The way he'll open his hips and show the 10 and 2 skating stride to freeze a defenseman if only for a second before accelerating past them. He's always keeping his opponents guessing. With that guile comes a fearlessness that is sure to endear himself to teammates and coaches alike when he makes it to the NHL. Few players in this draft can match the reckless abandon with which Demidov took the puck to the middle of the ice last season. And here's the thing, he isn't dangling for the sake of dangling. Every move serves a purpose, whether improving the quality of his look as a shooter or creating openings in the defense that he can exploit as a distributor. The same dexterity and touch that makes him so effective as a handler is every bit as present when he's ready to send the puck elsewhere. There's some concern among scouts that Demidov is prone to overhandling, a problem made worse by playing in a league several steps below his ability. That, along with the fact that his wide, unorthodox skating stride and an over-reliance on inside-edge maneuvers may limit his success at the NHL level. The potential is through the roof with Demidov, though, and he's only got one year left on his contract with SKA St. Petersburg. The biggest question for the Habs fans is, who do you think will have a season like Kovalev's point-per-game first? Slavkovsky, Suzuki, or Demidov? What kind of player do you think Demidov could become in the NHL? Kevin Fiala or Jack Hughes? Can Demidov become the first Habs player to
to reach 100 points in one season in the 21st century? Let us know your thoughts about Demidoff and answers to our questions at the end of the video. Don't forget to subscribe and like. Thank you to watching another Habs Nation video. But before we leave, we invite you, don't forget to click on the like, subscribe to the channel, and finally let us a comment about this video. And remember, you have greatness inside of you, and we wishes you an amazing, great, and blessing day.